Oh, we're walking here, and in this video, we're going to be taking a look at the uh, black wallet leather case for the Samsung uh, Galaxy Note 3. This is a cheap case that I picked off of eBay. I'll put the link to it in the description. I paid about four pounds for it. Um, this is a cheap case just to use until you get a nicer case for your um, Note 3. As you see, it's a very simple wallet style case. You've got um, compartments in here for maybe to your credit card or um, anything else. You've got a little compartment here which you can store your um, money in. And then you got the main part here where your uh, phone sits. Um, let's walk you through. This is not real leather, it's obviously fake leather, but it's got a good amount of pad in here. It's very, very soft here. You can feel that there's a, like a piece of board and then there's a soft padding over that. Same goes for the back. It does cut have uh, cutouts for all the ports so you can easily get access to it. And there's a magnetic um, lock right here. So, I'm going to install the phone, and if you can see there's a nice little soft material here which obviously prevents your the back of your phone from uh, being scratched up and keeps it safe. So to install it, it's pretty easy, we have to do slide it in, just kind of snap it into place and that's it. And you can see how it is locked, you can see how thick it is, it doesn't add that much uh, thickness to it. So you can see how it is, you still have access to your pen right here so you can still pull out your pen. Still have access to your um, low button, the uh, headphone jack at the top, the IR blaster, but it does cover up the headphones, um, the volume rocker right here. You, and I can't really feel where it is, you could try and guess, but it's very difficult. You will need to open the case and then adjust it right here. Um, like I said, it's got cards for the camera on the back and the LED flash. Once you open it up, um, you can see how it fits in there. The case does offer a good amount of protection. Um, when you have it closed, it does um, cover all four corners, but there might be like this bit right here, which is just slightly exposed. So if you drop it at like this angle, and um, there's a good chance it will hit it. So it's not really complete. It's not really protecting this bottom part, and I think the same goes for the top bit. But the top bit feels a bit more. Um, uh, covered and yeah, I've been using this for a couple of days now, and it's been great so far There's a few things that I did uh, notice that kind of annoyed me a little bit There's obviously the volume rocker there. It's kind of difficult to kind of access because once you can't actually um, Adjust it while maybe you just want to put your hand in your pocket and adjust the volume You have to take the phone out and then open it up and then adjust the volume So that is that's one thing that kind of bugged me and another thing that I did notice is when you have it closed in your pocket, there were times when I took the phone out and then I noticed the screen that um, was on. That's because the this part here was kind of touching against the home button which would wake it up. So that's another thing that annoyed me. It's not really a big issue but like I said it's a cheap case just to use for now until something better comes along. I will be doing some videos and some HTP cases and some other cases that are out there so stay tuned for that. And yeah that's about it for the video. Like I said, if you want to check this case out, I'll put the link to it in the description. You can pick it up off of eBay. And yep, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you want to see more. And thanks for watching. Peace.